Oh, g'day there guys, it's Mungu through there here and it's time for the Daily Diary. Your favourite time of day and my favourite time of day. <coughs> so I'm just hanging out in Pali, as you do. I uh, had a big day yesterday, let me tell you about that. I was up pretty early because uh, the Dutt man was on his way to day one of the conference. So I thought I'd better make use of my day. So I did. Got up early and walked from where we're staying to uh, to a little cafe that was north of the Louvre. So it was an hour and, a, hour and 40 minute walk to the Louvre. Oh yeah, it's another hour. I hope it's not too windy for this, but anyway, because the state of origin was on. Ah. And, uh, Mr. Plane would have been very devastated if we didn't at least try. So I got there for the last 20 minutes of the game and sat there on the side of the was quite obviously uh, the blue supporters because there was a lot of Queenslanders in there, loud and proud as they would be because they've won a few games, so they're very confident. But uh, anyway, from there I went and checked out a Masonic Freemasonry Museum. Just a little boat. And then uh, onto the Louvre where I spent, it might have been close to six hours walking around in there. Seen a very large portion of it. There might have been a couple of rooms I didn't see because the day was getting on. And I was, it was after 8.30 before I left. And I had to get back because the Dutt man was expecting me, the Dutt man back at our, the hotel. And I got there more like 9.30. <laughs> Having a bit of trouble getting my way home, I'd walked probably 20 plus k's around uh, Paris that day. And then, you know, a few k around just the loop itself. So I didn't want to work anymore. It was killing me today. Haven't done much walking today. I got the uh, metro in and went to... Where'd I go? The Catatomb. The Cato Catatombs. The place with all the bones in it. Which is pretty sweet. I had, a, I had a good time walking around in there. And now I was going to come down to La Tour Eiffel and let's go get a, just a half bottle of wine and sit in the park. I just look at it. But. I get here and the place is jammed up with this bloody Euro soccer thing. The whole park, the whole park. Like, you know, that side down is jammed up with this off of the um, Euro thing. Soccer. So that plane went out the window very quickly. But I'm very happy to at least be able to get in here because I thought I wouldn't be able to. So, yeah. yeah, the cat of terms, cat, cat of terms, however, whatever it's called, bought a souvenir, had lunch with these two American girls, because they were sitting at a cafe I went to afterwards, I just started talking to them, as you do, we had lunch together, good time, had half a bottle of wine, I was going to get another half, and sit up here, but she's a no-go, which is a shame. But I might, uh, might walk up this way, get a nicer view, and then make me way to the uh, RER and then piss off home. Because there's no point in me keep staying here. But, get a good glimpse. There she is. Hopefully I'll get a nice photo up this end. But, you know, I've had a good day tomorrow. I might go check out the, uh, the cemetery where my man, Oscar Wilde's buried. We'll see. But anyway, get another good, get another good whiff of that. There it is, the Tour of Peace, love, and step up. It's a good show. I've got the apple.